Huh. Hi, everybody. Hey, we're back. I'm Randy. I'm Tom. And, all right, here's the thing. We're at Galden because you can get double XP for 10 grand. However, there's also a... It turns out there's a hotel. What are you doing? <laughs> Talking to her. There's a hotel in Al back in Altissa that will give you times 3 XP. But how do we get to Altissa? Um, talk to, the same way we got here. Talk to the guy behind you who actually you'd normally rest at, and then call Umbra. Would you oh. Be staying the night with us? Umbra! Stupid bullshit pre-order bonuses. <laughs> Wait, what? One of the pre-order bonuses, if you had, like, pre-ordered this from Amazon instead of, um... Stop. Yeah. <laughs> One of the bonuses would have been an item that makes, like... Gas, repairs, upgrades to your car, and hotels. Half price. Oh, that's dumb. So like I said, stupid bullshit pre-order bonuses. Yeah, that's dumb. Are, are we gonna have any pictures Oh yeah, the of... fucking Adamantoys! Oh god, yeah, you guys missed that. Yo, that thing came out of nowhere. Oh. That thing walking around nearly put us in um, danger mode. We, we gotta make an episode of just like... Whether it's post-game content or just running around with crazy bosses, I don't know. Yeah. Just because at this rate, we might finish the game <laughs> so much earlier than we thought. Yeah. But So, yeah. you want to make any guesses on like how what level we're going to wind up at and how long it's been since I actually slept? <laughs> right now, we're at level 42, right. and Randy has added about 9 hours to playtime just grinding. Which comes to the order of something around 130,000 XP. Oh, God. I, <laughs> and with the XP scale, you'd say it would be around, like, 60? But there's also the fact that the Altissa one gives us times three. So What's that, even the level cap? I would assume 99 is usual. Ah! So we'll be hitting 400,000 XP. <laughs> and we're still going to suck at this game. <laughs> We're still going to die by the bosses, even as level 99. Let's take on the Animantois when we level up. All right. Is this the place? Yes, it's... One of them will do the normal one, one of them does times three. Greetings. Will you be nope, it's the other one. Very well. Yeah, you stupid blondie, get but out of the way. It's going to cost 30 grand, but luckily we have 93 grand. Oh, but... What were those weapons you wanted to get that were like 30 grand each? They were 10 grand a piece, oh, okay. and they... They were strangely roughly the same power as the ones we have now, but uh -huh. they had holy element on them. Ooh. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. Are you ready for this grand reveal? No Zero days. Days, alas. Does it only? Does it not count because we were in the past the entire time? Okay. I don't. I don't want to. I'm not prepared for this. You're not prepared. I think we're gonna hit seventy. This is Illidan Storm Rage. Alright, go. Oh, 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 no, no. 60 is the most we're gonna get, if even there. Dang it. Oh, uh, that was. 50. Oh, damn. Oh my god. <laughs> so that's, um. 13 levels. 15 14, levels. 15, 16, 16 17. Oh, oh my god. Gladiolus is so close. Oh, what? Holy shit. We're already level 59. And we're not that far in this story. We're about halfway through storyline. Oh, oh god. We need to not do every quest really? that's available. Hey, I didn't do, like, any hunts. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, if we tried to record... All the extra stuff Randy's been doing, it would be another 40 episodes of just that. Alright, might want to reset our um, quest to the current one. The summit. Oh, there's still a lot of quests. Yeah, some of those are like, bring stuff to Sid and he'll upgrade weapons. Some of them are just like, beyond the level I could have pulled off. Yeah. Alright. Alright, so now we are trying... We're going to Hillary Clinton's house. Which... I don't know where it is, but hopefully this is close. Oh, uh, I looked at the map. Trust in me, Randy! Put a little faith in me. It's not like I've led us astray before. <laughs> well, 
And then there's Megan's sense of direction, which was, is non-existent. I was going to loop around to Megan, but she might hit me for saying that. <laughs> Megan, please don't hit me. Well, you'll have at least a few days before she has a chance to hit you. <laughs> and I'll be gone by the time she records this. You mean edits this. <laughs> it, oh, fuck, you know what I meant. <laughs> Is this going to be a train wreck of a speaking session again? Dude, everything I say is a train wreck. When the moon hits your eye like a... Wait, no. When you're swimming in a lake and something touch your leg, that's amore. <laughs> Get it? Yeah. Because amore is yeah, an it's eel. Amore eel. Yeah. You can it... skip this, you know. Ah, oh, fuck. Can't <laughs> believe you've done this. And the loading time is going to be just as long. Yeah. No. Nope. Oh. oh. It has been a pleasure. Mm. Mm. I wonder if... Because there were some quests I had back in Lucis that had... Uh, basically, I had to... I had to rest to get them to advance. That's so I weird. wonder if resting here counted them and they'll be done when I get back. Huh. Because a couple of them were... Well, one of them was Sid upgrading a weapon for us. Another one was we were growing some plants. Ooh, I remember this is where the demo takes place. The uh, weird platinum thingy demo with Carbuncle. And you run around and I don't know what the fuck to do, so I quit. <gasps> Electri- Oh. That was another thing I couldn't do. I found another dungeon, but the things in there were kind of rough. Oh, God. We have a lot of magic flasks. <laughs> How does that one song go? Electric Avenue? We're gonna rock down to Electric Avenue, and then we'll take it higher, and that's all I can remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that song is a good song. What a good song. What do we have already? Quint cast, curse cast, We have no cast. fire. I'm trying to do electric right now just because there's electric in front of me. Death! We could try it. Mm, Moogle plushie. Oh. No. <laughs> Death by lightning. Death by Poonja. Death level 20. I All wonder right. if that means it'll automatically kill anything that's under level 20. Mm, I don't know. I think that's just the strength of the death spell. Maybe it's a 20% chance of death. Uh, and today's forecast calls for a 20% chance of death. <laughs> with light showers in the afternoon, if you make it. <laughs> Back to you with the sports. Fuck sports! I'm getting out of here! Venom fire. Ooh, that's fun. Alright, alright. Um, store. We should probably send, spend some of our AP. Oh, uh, let's do that outside of recording. It says it's right here. It says it's upstairs. Oh. Hillary Clinton, where are you? Ooh, ice. And fire. Unsurprisingly, they're all here. Oh. Hillary Clinton would hold all the elements in her basement. Slimy bastard bitch. Even though they look different, they don't really give you any more than the ones we found out and... I don't think any gives you any different. Maybe there's a, um... I'm pretty sure there's a skill for that. Hey, let me in, bro. Oh, look at all these people. All these completely random and unimportant people. Oh, sure. sure. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Fuck this city. All we really cared about in this city was that <laughs> motel, oh, hotel God, thing. look at that. Damn, that looks amazing. Damn. Hey, and short load time. Woo! Maybe there was... Oh, this might have been the new update they just put in. Oh, man. Did it turn off subtitles or are they not talking yet? There... Good, I don't think I could go through this again without subtitles. Thank you for coming. Oh, okay. thank God. <laughs> don't do that to me, Randy! Oh. Engage her in a manner befitting a king and strive to win her trust and cooperation. Oh, God, I can't do this! Hand it over. I'm not kingly! No sweat. First thing oh, God! Me. Oh, God, what do we do? Express gratitude. Ah! Pro probe! Probe her ass! <laughs> we'll do that later. Oh. God, that's nasty. <laughs> Westcom didn't extend me an invitation, so I decided to extend my own. Oh, Those man. circumstances have changed. 
You just, that outfit is just so unbecoming. Yeah, it really doesn't look all that kingly. Um, show concern. Because if they have her, what might they do to a Cordo? Who's a Cordo? The city we're in. Oh. Well, the nation we're in. Altus is the city, Cordo is the country. I really should be reading this so I don't fuck it up. Oh, yeah, okay. So they're trying. They're thinking about handing over Luna Freya to the. Uh. Dudes. Don't be truthful, not to this bitch! Oh, she. Okay. It can't be a simple oh. affair for you. See, I would have fucked this up already. <laughs> Let me be frank. I have some good diplomacy skills. Which I don't. Than most what took place in uh. with Archeon. Tell me, what happened? Be cheeky? Don't be cheeky. I was just wondering what would, <laughs> what kind of answer cheeky would get us. I'll show you my arcade. Woo! I still wonder how you can even summon those guys, because we did it once back at the base. But it was more of a prompt yeah. kind of thing. Prompt. Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh, Jesus. Saw my life flash before my eyes, and it sucked. Oh. I would say be realistic. A little late for that. If a battle took place in the city. Indeed. Be a shame if someone were to shit in your city. <laughs> oh god, what are you getting us into, Randy? Uh, I don't know. And it was to discuss your involvement in them that I called you here. Apparently she's about to tell us what we're getting into. I don't know what we're getting into. Talk terms. Yay! Pudgy hell Ensure the citizen safety and aid in their evacuation. Feign apathy. <laughs> Let's do more. Oh God, Randy, what have you done? To the city. Your concern is appreciated, but I am prepared to accept some structural damage. Oh yeah. Damage. Keeping the citizens safe is my chief concern, uh, and therefore yours. So how are we supposed to get all these people out of the city? Run around naked. Ugh, oh, that would... Well, depends on who it is, it might not scare people out of the city. Just run around naked with pots and pans. Get the fuck out of my city! Just banging. I come fighting. Yeah, I've kicked so many... Um... Asses. <laughs> yeah, uh, Empire ass. <laughs> I am a professional kicker of asses, lady. There was there was one like um off screen side quest that I did with where it was one of those base missions. Oh yeah. And it's like, alright, be sneaky and destroy things, and I got caught by the first light. <laughs> sneaky beaky. And like everything in the city ca in the base oh, came God. down on me at once. Oh, at God. one point, the entire mini map was just full of red enemy dots. Oh my God! How did you survive? A lot of items. <laughs> oh, did you buy new items? Or yes. Are we okay. My duty is I wound up the like final boss of that area was three of those mechs that were each level fifty one. Oh Jesus, that's gotta be fun. Return the threat. Just kidding, don't. Don't be a dick. I'll just remain silent. What? Don't do that. She's gonna think we're angsty. <laughs> well. I will stop it. Nothing to protect my people. What a little bitch. Killer. Oh, I don't have. <laughs> Apparently, if you choose the wrong one, you just get a re-choice. Do what you must for your people. Oh, You're man. just like your father. Or I guess it was just because you were silent then. What do you mean? What do you mean? Because I want to know more about Sometimes Noctis' is dad. Too bad he's dead. <laughs> oh. That Ouch. Was an Ow, okay. Fuck you! I'm holding my middle fingers up since you can't see. Fuck you! I mean, frick you. I'm trying to stop swearing as much. Oh, dang, so the Empire is attacking. That's fun. Ooh, yeah. Oh, shit. I left my DS in my dad's car. God! I'm an idiot! Yeah! We 
who won her unreserved trust. And four Oracle Ascension coins. Yay. <laughs> Thanks for the money, lady. And now we have enough experience to level Gladiolus up. Uh, yeah. And if we, like, find... She's a traitor. She's conspiring with the Empire. I... She's gonna totally fuck us up. Well, here's the thing. Accordo is, like, a nation in the Empire, so it wouldn't be all that surprising. Oh, she's gonna fuck us up the butt, metaphorically. I just remembered another really weird um, side quest. Gladiolus went like hardcore super fan on Cup of Noodles. <laughs> and then he had us go out and kill a behemoth so the next time we camp we can add behemoth steak to a cup of noodles. <laughs> What right? The right um, that's going to wake up Leviathan. Oh. So that we can get a pact with it. Oh. If you look to your left, you can see buildings! If you look to your right, you can see... More buildings! A naked person in their building who forgot to close the blinds. Oh, God. So, protect Leviathan. Yeah, that's... <laughs> Oh man. Detail. Indeed. The best we can realistically do is to help Oh, it's us by ourselves. And Leviathan's a girl. Oh, oh. That's unusual. Yeah. Usually Leviathan is the king of the summons, or at least he was back in they Final wanted, Fantasy 4. They wanted to make it more gender equal, I guess, cuz <laughs> there are six. We've got Titan, Bahamut, and Ramu, who are probably dudes. Well, Wait, when did we get Bahamut? We haven't, but he's out there. Oh. So, Shiva, Leviathan, and... Ifrit. I... That would be a gigantic change, but... Ifrit's gonna be... They shouldn't have genders. They're eternal beings. Uh, can we skip this? Nope. I can understand some of them having genders, but... Like, a dragon and a giant sea serpent? That doesn't make much sense. Titan, we saw, had no gen <laughs> genitalia. <laughs> and I guess if they say Leviathan's a girl, then Leviathan's a girl. There's no way that um, Shiva cannot be a girl, because... Well, yeah, she got boobs. Okay, I'm so confused. What? I don't know what's going on. So we're trying to summon make Leviathan and make her be our friend. Right. Luna Freya is going to perform a right to wake up Leviathan so that we can get a pact with her. Okay. But the Empire is at the same time going to try and kill Leviathan so we can't. Once it's over, you may go as you please. And so they're an Empire-controlled place, but they're trying to help us out. Right, because they hate the Empire. Most people do. And Luna Freya is just staying there because, like... This is her home city. Oh. I this thought, is where she and her brother are from. I thought she was from the wood place. Nope, that's just where... That may be somewhere else in Accordo. I thought that oh, we was got, their home. We got betrayed. Oh, Jesus. I told you! Can't trust anybody these days. Fucking Imperial shit wigglers. You fucking niffs. Aw. She's cute when she's angry and contemplating murdering everybody. It'd be funny if she... Oh, what oh. if Gentiana just appears and murders everybody? Just ninja ass, like... Oh. Yeah, yep. Yeah. And then we still see her in our pictures. <laughs> God damn it, genitalia. Go photobomb someone else. <sighs> loading, loading... What's the name of the place that was in the movie that Luna Freya and her dick brother were from? I could have sworn it was a Cordo, but seeing as they said it was taken over 150 years ago, I yeah. think that may be wrong. You guys too. I'm looking it up. Of course. Blend in with the crowd. Pretend oh. to be an angsty normal person. I just remembered another like idiotic side quest. Do a lot of those. Do you remember that cat? From oh, way yeah? back at the beginning, he was like, hey, bring me a fish. Well, it showed up again. 
and we can either... Then we gotta find a way through the crowd. Oh, or just wait. Either and way. the quest was to either, um... Go catch a fish yourself, or buy it some cat food. Oh my god. The cat food cost 20 grand. Oh my god. And the fish was like some kind of deep sea god thing as... It... Its stamina would not go down. <laughs> Oh, you called him the king of fishes? Tenebrae. I tried. Tenebrae. She's from Tenebrae. She was born and raised in Tenebrae, and then relocated here since she's an oracle. But I couldn't catch it. Oh, because it was a deep sea fish god? It broke my line. <laughs> so, you let the fish starve? You mean the cat? God damn. You let the... God, I quit. I quit. I'm sorry, guys, but I quit. I can't do this. Terror, hatred, and sorrow in the hearts of men. Woo! Make America great again! Woo! I mean, the not America. Uh, Accordo! Make Accordo great again! Woo! Yeah! Into a nightmare of death and destruction. Oh. Cor! Those dudes. Eris and Talcat. Knock this! Do not surrender this would be really, prayer. probably emotional if we had sound on. It probably has some really amazing music right now. <laughs> do, 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 do. This reminds me of like what April and I were playing Ten recently, yeah. and we got to the point where Luna Frey is all sad. And you're in Luna the Frey, not you mean Yuna. Yes, <laughs> Yuna and Tia have that really emotional scene where they're like in the water. Oh, and the, they're having sex, but they're personifying it. Not as sex. Yeah, and Maggie was there as well. And none of us were paying attention. <laughs> oh God! I offer you my solemn vow. I was playing this random RPG, and they had a scene like that that was totally just banking off of that scene from Final Fantasy X. It was just ripping off it so hard. It was awful. I wonder how terrible that sounds. <laughs> oh. Bless you all! God bless us, everyone! Okay, little Timmy. <laughs> I wonder if she can see us. Yeah, well, she's yeah. us. But. Why okay, we're not. We're like in the middle of an open spot in the <laughs> crowd. Is that Prince Noctis? No, no, nah, no, nah, he totally wouldn't just stand there in the middle of the crowd. He's not that stupid. Phone call. The Empire's here. Oh. Oh, yeah, really? <laughs> I still think their dropships look like robotic whales. Yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> That's their mating call. But they have little dropship babies. All right, you ready for this epic battle that we're probably gonna lose? That we'll probably have to wait until next time. <laughs> yes, it'll have to wait until next time. Okay. See you all next time. Bye.